guys! So this video is going to be a review and a lip swatch video of this beautiful little palette by Bobbi Brown. This is the University Lip Palette. I got mine from Sephora and I checked a few weeks ago and they weren't selling it at Sephora anymore but if they are I will link it down below. They also sell this at Nordstrom. They sell this through Bobbi Brown's actual website and any other place that I can find it I will link it down for you below. Okay. So this palette comes with 12 shades and these, what I think is so great about this palette is that these are all Bobbi Brown's original lipsticks, like these are actual legitimate lipsticks that you can buy from her line. So it's so great that it comes in a palette like this. This is what it looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and get to the lip swatches and then at the end of the video I will do a little review and let you know about each individual shade and let you know my thoughts on them and then I'll also put a little asterisk by the title of each lipstick that I consider my favorite just so you know so let's just go ahead and get started
so now that all the lip swatches are done we can talk about the colors individually now these are some of the creamiest lipsticks that i've ever used each one is creamy none of them are really matte but some of them are more creamy than others i forgot to mention in the beginning of the video this is a 60 dollars palette and it comes with a really really nice smear and i think the packaging is just really really cute i love to just i've used this in a couple videos to put makeup on and stuff and i just i love bobby brown um, she's just kind of like a sentimental brand and person to me when I was younger I read all of her makeup books which I can link down below if you guys are not really familiar with Bobbi Brown she makes fantastic makeup books she's an amazing makeup artist and I really like her as a person I think she is just really creative and I also think that she's really encouraging and she thinks you know beauty is something that encompasses all ages and all di all different people it's all inclusive and I really just like that I like her message and I think she's just a really awesome person so that's what really kind of drew me to get this palette plus like I said it's really cool that these are lipsticks that are a part of her line anyway so you get to try a variety of lipsticks from her so there were two that I had kind of trouble with this salmon one right here and then this color in blackberry is, is that right yeah, and Blackberry, which this Blackberry color reminds me a lot of Max Rebel. These were super, super creamy, and I felt like they really wanted to move around on my lips. It was hard to kind of get them to stay in place. Some of them are a little bit more matte than others. Not necessarily matte, but I guess they're like less creamy. Like some of them are super creamy. Like this red one right here is a little bit less creamy, and then this pink one's a little less creamy. This color right here, this is the Beige Gold Shimmer. That's what I have on my lips right now, and I think this is really, really cute. This is supposed to be kind of like a lipstick, a lipstick topper if you want to give it a little bit of sheen, a little bit of like metallicness. I think this is so, so, so cute. Uh, before today, I didn't really dig into that color a whole lot. Um, this color right here, this is Berry Shimmer. This is also a shimmery color. This is really, really creamy as well. This color was also kind of wanting to spread a lot, but I mean, I could see that because it definitely is more of like a shimmery color. But I just love this palette. I think this would make a perfect gift for a makeup lover. It's beautiful. My only complaint about it is I don't think it's necessarily like travel friendly. It doesn't come with a brush and then even if it did, you know, your brush is going to be dirty and it's like, you know, you probably need a separate compartment to put it in and I just really wish that it came with a brush. I think if you're going to make a lipstick palette or a palette like this, it should include one because how else are you going to apply it? I mean, you could use your finger, but... I wouldn't recommend that, you know, getting germs and stuff in it. I really don't have anything bad to say about this at all. Like I said, I think this would make a beautiful, beautiful gift for someone if you're a makeup artist or someone you know is a makeup artist or someone just loves lipsticks and lip products. This is an amazing way to try a lot of variety from a really, really amazing brand. I mean, Bobbi Brown is like an iconic makeup brand and I really think the price is worth it like I just think this palette is amazing it's gonna last you a really long time and to me it's just there's something sentimental about Bobbi Brown and this palette just kind of I don't know it represents something to me like a part of my childhood and getting to know makeup and getting familiar with makeup kind of through her and her kind of teaching me and guiding me into makeup and stuff like that so yeah, I would highly, highly recommend this if you guys are looking for a great gift for someone. This is an amazing palette. So you get like a lot of different shades. I will say my favorite of all of them are the red shades. I think they're really, really well done. The nude shades are really nice too. I just think that like this color and this color right here are like super similar. This one's a little bit more pink and a little more pale but when I was swatching them on my lips I couldn't really tell much of a difference but the reds are so well done I think like I said I put an asterisk beside the ones that I like the most I really love this red one right here it's got like a, an oranginess to it and I just love that I think it's so interesting and it's so pretty on the lips like these just swatch really well it's like one swipe and the color is just so rich I, I just I love her reds I think the reds are the best part of this palette I love this shimmer right here but all of them I think are really well done like I don't really have any complaints about any of them and also this is coming from someone who's more into like matte lipsticks and these are all creamy they just feel really good and I think they're beautiful on the lips and you just you get a lot of variety you get 
you know, kind of more bright colors, more eccentric colors, but then you also get like everyday colors, you get berry colors, you can mix these. There's just so many ways to use this. You could even, if you wanted to, use it as a cream blush or, you know, just, I just think it's an amazing, amazing palette. This also came with a little booklet that um, explained each of the colors and told you all the color names and stuff like that. I'm not sure where mine is, but on the back it tells you all the color names anyway, so that's good to have on hand. And they're easy to remember. It's like rose, red, burnt red, orange, you know, so it's not hard to remember. And then the brushes that I used, I was alternating a bunch of brushes because I didn't feel like cleaning it in between, but... The main brush that I used came from a set from Amazon, it was just a little flat shader brush for your eyes and then yeah I just grabbed like some eye brushes to swipe on the color a little bit. Anything like flat is good but these feel insanely comfortable on the lips so if you're someone who really doesn't like matte lips, you like to have that moisture, these are so so good. These are some of the creamiest lipsticks I've ever felt and it, it really feels good especially to apply it with a brush. It just glides on and it's just such a smooth buttery application. It just it feels good on your lips. I don't know. It's like painting. I just I love it. So yeah like I said I will link down below where you guys can purchase this palette. I, like I said I don't know that Sephora is still selling it, but if they are, I will link that down below because it's probably the easiest place to get it from, at least it is for me. And also feel free to let me know in the comments what your guys' favorite colors were. I just love all of them. Like I don't, there's not a color that I dislike. There's just some that I really, really, really love and I'm drawn to. So yeah, that's all I have to say for this video. Let me know what you guys think and I will see you in my next video. Bye.